And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. It certainly was a kind of dreary weekend, pretty cloudy, had some on and off rain showers this morning. Uh, waking up pretty cool out there off to the east. We're in the mid 40s, 46 Peru, Galveston, 49 here in Lafayette, stuck in the 50s there, Pine Village, Attica and Covington. Temperatures won't move much this morning due to increased cloud cover, but the low still kind of responsible for that northwesterly flow well off into the Atlantic now and you can see that north wind, the high pressure kind of helping bring in that cooler air for us and still uh, those clouds coming off of Lake Michigan to the north and we're still going to be seeing a cloudy day, but we had a little trough move through uh, and that gave us a couple rain showers. Most of us less than a tenth of an inch here at the Purdue Airport, about a trace amount, so not much rain fell, but things are certainly a little wet outside. As you can see, we're mostly cloudy. So the clouds may thin out just a little bit later this morning, but then we'll cloud right back up after lunchtime and we may see more patchy drizzle this afternoon. Nothing widespread, kind of like what we saw yesterday where it was cloudy for most of the day, maybe some sun in the morning and we'll reach back into the mid 50s for the afternoon with that north northwest wind. About 10 15 miles per hour we shift to tomorrow. We shift that wind as well to west southwest wind. that's going to warm us up even more and we're finally going to get some drier air in here in the atmosphere that's going to allow us to possibly get more sun out by the afternoon hour. So that's good news there. Tuesday looks pretty good. Wednesday looks even better. I'll break that down here in just a few minutes, but mostly cloudy today. Again, a few peaks of sun this morning will cloud back up this afternoon and can't rule out just some isolated areas of light drizzle, but otherwise we're good. Tuesday will start off a little cloudy here and there and then more sunshine in the afternoon and looking good for Tuesday as well. Wednesday may see some mid high level clouds start to stream in with our next system coming in by Wednesday night. And we'll be seeing that southerly flow on Wednesday. That's going to really help warm us up into the mid to upper 60s. So not too bad of a day Wednesday, but late Wednesday into a Thursday morning. We may have a shower or a storm or two coming in. This will not be working with a lot of moisture, so we're not thinking of a widespread event here, but it will kind of linger once again with some scattered showers Thursday maybe into Friday morning as well. So nothing too widespread, crazy, uh, everybody getting rain wise. So we're seeing the better chance of rain coming in Wednesday night throughout the day on Thursday, kind of a cloudy, dreary day. We'll cool down slightly 60 on Friday, 57 Saturday with some of those scattered showers. Another kind of system rolls through for the weekend. Again, not really impressive. But something to keep note of as we get toward the rest of your work week, maybe just a, another quick shower or two Saturday, Sunday, and then we'll stay in the 60s for next week at Asa. All right, e. Davis, so basically we just got to wait till Wednesday. That's when we'll see, you know, the warmest day yeah, of the week. Wednesday's looking fantastic, you know, mid to upper set, uh, 60s to near 70 in spots, but uh, got to get through today. Another cloudy one, just like yesterday, so, uh, but relief is on the way. Definitely. Thank you so much, David. Of course.